Shubha Shandha, good evening, Salam Alaikum and Namaskar. I don't know people are coming and I hope that people will <laughs> end up entering the hall before we start the movie. But uh, what a great pleasure it is for me as High Commissioner of Bangladesh to the UK to stand next to the High Commissioner of India to the UK, uh, my good friend uh, Vikram Dora Swami, as the two High Commissions in the historic month of December when Bangladesh celebrates our glorious war of liberation in the month of victory that we have brought here uh, some of our Bangladeshi British and Bang uh, Indian British diaspora and our honorable advisor to our Prime Minister, Dr. Professor Bahaj Rizvi, and also his family, and uh, so many other distinguished One of the most famous uh, parallel cinema maker, Shan Benigalji, had directed and produced this movie. Uh, and the productions are done by the Information Ministry of India and the Information Ministry of Bangladesh. So this is one of those things that you celebrate from two angles. Number one is that this is the month of December, that month when we celebrate Bangladesh's glorious victory over the Pakistan occupation forces where they had surrendered to Bangladesh India Joint Command and also we celebrate Bangladesh Bharat Maitri that means the friendship between Bangladesh and India as on 6 December uh, you know, 1971 India recognized Bangladesh and the armed forces of India fought with our valiant freedom fighters and our armed forces of Bangladesh. So therefore, as we celebrate the month of December, we are very, very proud to organize this event where we present this movie. And this is a three-hour movie where you get a glimpse of the life and legacy and the struggle of one person, one leader from South Asia, who is the father, we call him the father of Bengali nationalism, who based on Bengali nationalism, struggled and struggled and fought for the rights and freedom of people of Bangladesh and the Bengali people. And, uh, you know, Bangabandhu uh, Sheikh Mujib's um, legacy with, um, uh, you know, as, as the leader of the uh, freedom movement of Bangladesh, as well as his um, historic friendship with India, as well as his historic friendship with the United Kingdom. As when he was released from Pakistan, he came to, on 8 January, he came to the United Kingdom, received a number 10 by Prime Minister Edward Heath, and then he went on to New Delhi on 10 January before he returned to independent Bangladesh. And there he was received by India's President Vidya Giri and Prime Minister Shimati Gandhi. So the friendship between Bangladesh and India and the friendship of Bangladesh with the United Kingdom and our two countries with the UK are historic. It does bear a historic significance. So sitting in London, we are all, you know, having a large uh, Bangladeshi, uh, a very small segment uh, of Bangladeshi diaspora friends and Indian diaspora friends. Uh, we celebrate this movie, and I hope that in this movie you will get uh, an evidence. You know, you you will be witness to what happened between 19, uh, you know, since Sheikh Mujib was born in 1920, and when he was brutally assassinated along with his entire family in 1975. And one more thing I'd especially like to recognize this movie. Before I saw this movie, I have seen it. The contribution of the woman behind Sheikh Mujib, Begum Mujib. Uh, what a role she played, how sacrifices she made, that will also be, you'll be witnessing that here. So I hope that next three hours you'll enjoy the movie and I pay a tribute to our father, the nation, whom, um, you know, Indian Nobel laureate Amartya Shen, when we organized a uh, talk at the LSE, has, we call him Bongo Bontu, it means friend of Bengal, but Amartya Shen said he was a friend of the world, Vishwa Bontu. And why? Because of the secular values, the inclusive values, and the freedom loving, you know, the humanity that he has demonstrated towards all the people in the world, all the values that he carried, secularism, democracy, and inclusiveness. So with these words, I once again want to reaffirm Bangladesh's um, unending friendship with India, and uh, the connectivity and the uh, last decade of um, uh, so much that has been achieved between Prime Minister Modi and Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina. But I want to specially express my gratitude to the two Prime Ministers for this co-production, which we are witnessing today. And also, I want to say, joy Bangla, joy Hind, and long live Bangladesh-UK friendship as well. Thank you.